Starship doesn't just fall back to Earth, it actually flies through the atmosphere while falling. When this massive 165-foot upper stage, part of the full 400-foot Starship stack, returns from orbit at nearly 17,500 miles per hour, it doesn't come down nose first or tail first like a capsule. Instead, it flips onto its belly and performs one of the most dramatic maneuvers in modern rocketry, the belly flop re-entry. In that position, Starship spreads its broadside against the atmosphere, creating enormous drag that helps slow it down while distributing the intense heat of re-entry over a wide area. But flying sideways through plasma isn't stable. Without control, the ship would start tumbling violently. That's where its four giant steel flaps come in, two near the nose and two near the tail. These flaps aren't wings in the traditional sense. They're precision control surfaces that let Starship surf through the air. Each one moves independently, adjusting by just a few degrees at a time. Those tiny adjustments change how air pushes against different parts of the vehicle, shifting the center of pressure and allowing the flight computer to control the ship's orientation. It's the same principle as a skydiver spreading or tucking their arms and legs to steer. But in Starship's case, the skydiver weighs over 120 tons, travels faster than Mach 20, and is wrapped in a sheath of superheated plasma. Sensors across the hull constantly measure velocity, pressure, and rotation, feeding data to onboard computers hundreds of times every second. Those computers command the flaps in real time, turning raw physics into control, balancing chaos, drag, and stability in one of the harshest environments any spacecraft can face. As the atmosphere thickens, the flaps work even harder. By increasing their angle, they generate more drag to slow the vehicle. By flattening out, they let Starship maintain speed and control authority. Every movement affects the descent path, ensuring the ship doesn't come in too steep or too shallow. Then comes the most dramatic part, the landing flip. Just seconds before touchdown, the lower flaps fold in and the upper flaps assist as Starship pitches from horizontal back to vertical. The engines ignite in a burst of fire, taking over from the flaps to complete the landing burn. What looks like chaos is actually an intricate ballet of physics and software. Thousands of calculations per second, controlling tons of moving steel. If that thought gives you chills, make sure to follow for the next deep dive. The Starship story is just getting started.